Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Octopath Traveler 2. This is the last part of Hikari's story. And that being said, we're going to hop right into it. And let's face it all together with Hikari. Hopefully we can change the coup. There you are, brother. You did well to cut through my men. Your strength belies your sullied birth. Mugen. Your lust for power has caused too much pain. No more. Absurd. Your corpse shall rot along with the rest of them. Be honored that your death will feed the glory of Clan Ku. I think not. I was weak before. I couldn't protect those close to me. But it will be me who strikes you down and brings an end to this misery you've sown. Let's go, Hikari. You got spud. Oh, he's on a horse. The shame of Clan Ku. Your lowborn blood will be honored with a place on my blade. I will not let rage compel my sword. I do not take vengeance for the deaths of my father and mother. No. Today, I fight for my friends. Oh. Sentimental fool. Okay, Ready? lightning. Calculations complete. Weakling, a child could best you. This isn't over. My allies. My allies give me strength. <laughs> oh, he's laughing. Strength. Strength. Strength is to exert your will upon others, to make them bend to it or break. What do you know of strength? I mean... To see your enemy bleed, to make them know their place as your blade runs them through. Today, you will know yours, brother. Huh. <laughs> Today... Today, I fight for my friends. Uh oh, that car is starting to slip. You're powerless. Oswald. He's on MP again. Which is not the best. Uh. Mm -hmm. My spear does not err. <clears throat> Calculations in pursuit of knowledge. Roar, thunder. Cleaning time. Okay. I don't. I'm sorry, but I won't hold back. Thank me later. I'm not dead yet. What to do? What to do? I mean, he should be wounded. Poison slash. My turn. Maybe not enough to fall over, but how's this? My turn. So that's your weakness. No. Feel my wrath. Okay, he should. Roar, thunder. You're finished. I've gained valuable insight. Hmm. Good. Why? It's over, Mugen. I won't ah, lose to one too. of such low birth. Clan Ku is proud and was made great by its forebears who crushed their foes to dust. 
But our father tarnished himself with the company of a commoner. That wretched woman corrupted him. Her compassion infected him, and the light of her bloodline lives on through you. Her clan had once long ago attempted to save the world. Oh. To deliver it from the shadow. The shadow? Compassion cannot build greatness. It was strength that led Clan Ku to glory, and strength alone. <sighs> and so I took it upon myself to eradicate that bloodline from the world. But you survived, and not even I could find a way around Father's protection. Now I'll snuff out the light. Curious. There. I'm curious. There is none worthy to be my foe. None. <sighs> uh oh, the rage is starting to get to him. Do it, Ikari. What? It speaks to you. Uh oh. Hikari, take his head. Show him that your bloodline is the only one worthy to rule. Uh oh. The strong prevail, and the weak are struck from the pages of history. Such is the nature of the world, right? Go away. You're not wanted here. Come now, Hikari. It's time we decide which of us is worthy to Richard carry on. shadow? Which of us is worthy to bear our name? No. Today. Today I end this accursed blood feud. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We must challenge ourselves. Oh, this is going to be hard. Raise your weapon. Come now, Hikari. It's time we decide which of us is worthy to carry on. <laughs> I will swallow you whole, Hikari. Now you learn the foolishness of your ideals. I admit I lived in fear of you. In fear of what your existence meant. I was weak. So you... You are breaking my heart, Ikari. Allow me to relieve you of your burden. Give me your body, mind, and soul! This is not a thing to turn off all the wood. I won't. Oh. <laughs> it's pointless oh, to resist, him up. Ikari. Oh, how is he trying to get out? Yo. Today, you become me. Ah, dog. I was, I was on the... I was beating you up. <laughs> Eagle puts his trust in you, Hikari. This future you've envisioned, it's worth wagering my life on. Kazan. I was afraid, but no longer. I won't leave your side again. Come on, Hikari, you do You fight. gave me that courage, Hikari. Right, me. Hikari. Change, Ku. Rebuild it with your own hands. Ritsu. Oh, I can move again. What? Impossible. By this well Oh. I was weak before. But I'm not alone. I won't cower in fear anymore. Let's go. <laughs> Too slow. <laughs> Here I go. 
Oh, I did. I just I just went all in. Let's just hit him with the old. Let's just hit him with that again. He's about to. I anyway. summon Brand, the Thunder Blade. <laughs> Don't forget, Hikari. I'll always be watching over your shoulder, waiting. No, no, Kari, go in there, hug him. Farewell, imposter. It's like, no, you're a part of me. Never win. You conquered it. You, the shame of our bloodline. How? I will do anything to see you brought low, Mugen. Anything. Now let us end this. Silence, you fool. You proud, arrogant fool! I have not been defeated yet. Uh-oh. The Dark Blood Blade shall give me power. Uh, I don't the know. The power to crush my foes, to enshroud the world in darkness. Oh, okay. He's lost it. Behold my strength and kneel. <laughs> no. Well, he ain't no one anymore. He's not possessed. You're not Mugen. Oh! <sighs> oh. Quench the flames. Call out to the night. He's been consumed entirely. Even so, I will allow you no quarter. One way or the other, we fight for the final time, brother. Quench the flames. Call out to the night. It oh. ends here, brother. Oh, that is ten. You're in for it now. I've got you. You've been exposed. Ready? Okay. You saw it, but I won't hold back. Watch me. Aver, think of me easy. All tidied up. So long, I forgot your face. You've aged under that armor, become a corpse yourself. The curse of our clan took everything from you. Unlucky. Prince Hikari. Kazan. Is it finished? It is. Well done, my prince. Now, everyone's waiting. 
We need someone to lead the Chia to our victory. <sighs> of course. My friends, Mugen is defeated. Lower your weapons. The war is over. Today, we cheer for victory. Let's go. I, your highness. We won, my brothers. Yeah. Yeah! Several days after returning to the coup. What are you dawdling for? Hurry! We've been invited! Let's go! It's not every day you get to see a king be crowned. Oh, they're all going. <sighs> Are you ready, Your Majesty? This crown is even heavier than it looks, Benke. It's been passed down through generations. That's the weight of our nation's history on your shoulders. Now, yeah, the people Hikari's are waiting. Style. Then let us greet them. He will lead the coup into a new one. A new stride of peace. The crown suits you better than I could have imagined. Let's raise a glass to the new king. We've arrived at this day thanks to your eagle eye, Kazan. The only liquor sweeter than victory is peace. True. At last, we can finally share that drink. Eh, my king? At last. I wouldn't say that now. We got a long way from You were right from peace. the beginning, Hikari. Now I can walk with my head held high because I did not shy away from my destiny. I never lost faith in you, Raimei. And you'll never have reason to. You have steadfast friends in Clan Mei. Likewise. It's awesome. King Hikari! Your Majesty! The crown is heavy indeed. Perhaps too heavy. Nah, you got this. People of Ku, today I become your king. But I stand before you as a friend. What's he doing? Where'd that crown go? <laughs> Never change, Hikari. Ku has been a nation trapped in a cycle of bloodshed. Our history is stained crimson. We stand upon countless sacrifices, countless victims. No longer, never again will we pay for prosperity with blood. The territories we have conquered, the clans we have subjugated. Today, I set them free. Today, I crush the yoke of Ku's tyranny forever! And today, we set foot into a future where we are not bound by birth, wealth, or status, but joined in fellowship and love. Even so, we mustn't forget those who came before. The blood that was shed, the friends who were lost, they have guided us here, and together we shall all build a better, better home. home. 
Oh, look, bro, future, but... And at last, Ku's eternal war was brought to an end. From that day forward, the Ku extended only <clears throat> open arms to its neighbors. Together they pledged the light of peace would shine forevermore. Never again would the fires of war rage across these lands. Lord Hikari. Nika, I'm here to offer my apologies. Ritsu and I were unable to walk side by side. <laughs> War is something I've learned to live with. My brother... I know he killed a lot of people. But I don't understand why. Why did we have to fight for so long? <sighs> Lord Hikari, do you remember that day we all looked up at the sky together? I do. It's different now. Look, there's not a cloud in sight. I I don't know what you're seeing, but I'm seeing a lot of clouds. Just want to say that. Well, folks, that is the end. We have finally finished Hikari's story. Thank y'all so much for taking this journey with me. Truly another story that has been told. And it was quite enjoyable. But alas, this is the end of his storyline. We got about three or four more people left to go. And then we will close Octopath Traveler 2. Final chapter together. But that time is not near. But it is time to end this video. Thank y'all so much. Take care. I do look forward to seeing y'all again. In the next one. Until then. Goodbye.